notice that there is 1 minus sine x in the denominator of one term and 1 plus sine x in the denominator of the other term. We want to make the denominator of both terms same, so we can add them. And to do so, we will multiply and divide the first term by 1 plus sine x and the second term by 1 minus sine x. This makes the denominator of both terms 1 minus sine squared x. We are now going to use the identity sine squared x plus cosine squared x equal to 1 to write 1 minus sine squared x as cosine squared x. The numerator simply reduces to 1 when the two terms are added together. So the sum is equal to 2 over cosine squared x which is same as 2 secant squared x.